Welcome. I bid you welcome. This is John Clauser from my music corner of the world. Welcome to Transformed Tuesday. This is where I talk about how certain music, movies, events shaped my faith and kind of changed me in my heart for God. And so today I'm going to talk a bit about something that had happened to me early on in my walk. And this was what was telling me that my heart was being changed. And so the moment this came in early 1998. And um, what happened was, is I was watching a movie that I was about to, I was just about to watch some movie, something that I watched from my, my uh, wild days, I guess. And, and you have to understand the kind of stuff that I was gravitating towards were stuff that was more along the lines of, yeah, it was horror, but mostly there had to be a pretty good percentage of female nudity. Let's just say that. Okay. That was the kind of stuff I, I leaned towards, you know, very, you know, just very perverse in my soul, you know, and perverted my heart. So, and perverted my mind. So for whatever reason, I was going to watch one of these movies. Um, and it was an old, it was a, a old movie from the seventies, a real, just a disgusting movie, really, when you stop to think about it. Um, and I started watching this and I was like, I started feeling like, like Malcolm McDowell's character in Clockwork Orange. So if you remember Clockwork Orange, there's, he, in order to kind of rehabilitate him, he would be strapped down to a chair with his eyes, you know, literally peeled open to where he couldn't close them. They would put drops in his eyes and they would force him to watch um, scenes of violence while Beethoven's Ninth, which was one of his favorite pieces of music, was playing in the background. And the idea was so to desensitize him to the idea of, of committing violence and things of that nature. So that when, if he would, something like that's happened to him, you know, or where he would want to do that, he literally would throw up about it or something like that. While mine's not quite that graphic, I certainly could feel, I felt just disgusted that I was taking the time to watch something so perverse and so just, nasty and disgusting and i eventually i think i just either gave it away or i threw it away i can't remember what i did with it now but um yeah but i could feel you know i was i had already started feeling that way towards music um i was getting away from a lot of secular music especially the especially the heavy stuff i was listening to at the time i was listening to a lot of slayer uh, of course wasp was was a band that i was really into uh, even though I've gotten back into them now. Um, but I, I got, I got away from a lot of that stuff because it was just, I, it wasn't, I could feel my soul be so angry and I didn't want, I, I didn't want that in my life. I didn't need that. I needed, I wanted to be more uplifting and more positive. So I could feel that change. I feel, I could feel like I could listen to God, just tell me, okay, this is what needs to happen. So so that was when I, it was like, this was like early 1998. So I'm going to guess about, I don't know, February, March, something like that. So, um, so, you know, when, when I, I, I don't quite feel those tuggings now, obviously if I watch this kind of stuff, I, I take it now with a grain of salt. Um, but, um, I don't go out of my way to watch really perverse stuff. Obviously I don't go out of my way to watch perverse stuff anymore. That's just, no, that. There's, I don't need that in my life anymore. So I, I've, I don't, I don't tend to watch that kind of thing anymore. Um, even, even horror. I mean, I'll watch most of it, but I just can't, I just can't do anything really sick and disgusting. Mm -hmm. So um, anyway, so uh, that's my transform Tuesday for today. Um, just a little moment in time uh, where I just feel like God was uh, really speaking to my heart and trying to get me to, uh, just to change and to, to look more to him and to let him guide me um, and my choices and what I watched and listened to. So um, there you go. Uh, 
you know, uh, let me know what you think about, uh, you know, if you've had these kind of moments in your life where you've, you've had a faith change and, you know, you felt like God was speaking to you about something that you were doing and, you know, maybe it's time to get away from that. So, uh, all right. So fat Johnny metal, John Klaus of the metal dad here and, uh, from my music corner and, uh, we'll see you next week. God bless. <laughs>